Welcome to evening prayer on this Thursday evening here at St. John's. Still dwelling in the gospel reading from Easter Sunday and thinking about that stone that was rolled away. Matthew writes after the Sabbath as the first day of the week was dawning. Mary Magdalene and the other Mary went to see the tomb and suddenly there was a great earthquake for an angel of the Lord descending from heaven came and rolled back the stone and sat on it. Matthew is the only one that has the account of an angel sitting on the stone. It always makes me smile trying to imagine the sense of confidence and joy that angel must have had. This pandemic is a stone that would threaten us to threaten to separate us from God. But we know because we dwell in this story that there is nothing that can do that. The stone might be the pandemic, it might be the fear, the anxiety, but whatever it is, it cannot separate us from God. We pray tonight, especially for our friends in Marumba Parish our companion parish in Tanzania, they have a stone from a rock slide, a large one that is blocking a main road into the village and causing great hardship. So we remember them as we give thanks for the fact that there is nothing that can separate us from God's living love. I invite you into prayer. We pray to you, Almighty God, in this time of pandemic, for you are our refuge and our strength, a very present help in times of trouble. Do not let us fail now in the face of the events of these days. Uphold us with your love and give us the strength that we need. Help us in our confusion and anxiety and guide all our actions. We pray tonight for our friends in Mramba that you would help them to find a way around that stone in the road, that they might dwell in safety and have adequate food and shelter. Also, we pray, heal those who are sick tonight console those who are grieving and protect those who are innocent and helpless. Deliver us, we pray, through the hours of this night into the beauty of the morning. We pray in the name of the risen Lord. Amen. And our benediction from the Iona community in Scotland. May God who is present in sunrise and nightfall, may God who is with you when you sit and when you stand, may God who knows your path and the places where you rest, be with you now in your waiting, be your good news for sharing and lead you in the way that is everlasting. Amen. Thank you for joining me for prayer. I'll see you tomorrow.